we'll guide you through how to add a printer to your Mac. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. And this is if you've got a wired printer, like using a USB cord, and if it's wireless. So firstly, if you've got a wired printer, then make sure you connect it into your Mac. And if it's wireless, make sure you set it up and connected it to the network. And make sure your Mac is connected to the same network or Wi-Fi, whatever. Once all of that is done, then we can go and add it on our Mac. So go and open up your settings by clicking on your settings on your Mac. Now your settings may look slightly different to mine, but all the same stuff is still here. It just looks slightly different. So what we need to do is find our printer settings. So on the left here, you can just scroll down and see it here. If you can't find it, you can always use the search function either in the top left of these settings or in the old look of Mac settings, it'll be in the top right. And you can just search printers and then you can go and click on it. And then what you need to do is go and click on add printer scanner or fax and you get this pop up here and it's then going to go and search for printers. And as you can see, it's going to found mine here. So if yours has been found, go and click on it and then it's going to go and gather some information. Just wait and you can name it um, and you can also change the use. But yeah, you shouldn't need to change that. And then you can click on add. Now, if yours isn't appearing here, then what you can do is come to the top and you can tap on IP and you can go and manually connect using the IP address. And you're probably wondering, well, where is this? where well, you can find it in your printer settings. So go on your printer and you should be able to locate it. Or maybe it'd be in your printer manual as well, but you should be able to find it. But in my case here, it automatically appeared. So I can go to the default tab here and click on my printer, wait for add to be available and go and click on it. And it'll then say setting up and then it'll go and create it and it'll go and sort of set everything up necessary for the printer to work. And as you can see, we've now gone and added it. And so now you can close off your settings and I'll just go and open up this document here. Um, and let's say I want to go and print it. I'd go to the top left and click on file, then go down to print, or I could press on command and P and we can open up the print menu. And then you can choose your printer at the top here and then you can go and click on print. And that's that, you can print stuff off. If you found this guide useful, then please leave a like.